Janna. Forget being in the same tier on the list. They're not even on the same list or on the same piece of paper. Kai Sorel has been dominating League of Legends here for a while now, and Sivir and Janna are both still champions in the game, and that's about all I can really stop that if the 100 Thieves bottom lane duo down here decides they want to go in. You have to. You, you, if you did not stop the tournament, the Rel engage with Janna, why did you even pick the Janna? Oh no, well there you go. Why'd you even pick the Janna? The damage comes out and Newbie goes down. Even though he threw out the tornado, it didn't stop the CC. But Niles shows up here with a teleport. FBI wants to try to take down Sticks A if he can. FBI likely to die and there you go, baby. Niles says take a drink and he evens up the game. He's without punishing and thus the Janna becomes a much more reactive pick. And in the game that favors speed, assertiveness, reacting to the enemy oh. too much. Wait a minute. A Blaze Olive is going right in there, trying to just get up in the face of the Olaf, and he would have won in a 1v1, but League of Legends is a team game, and Demonte shows up to take the kill, to help his jungler, and to put a Blaze Olive in the dirt. I love so much that we started this game with the sot between the Monte and the yes. Blaze Olive. Because a Blaze Olive is saying, yeah, you know what? He probably thinks he's the better mid laner, which is going to allow me to make those big from that one. He's trying to run. The ball shows up. Ragnarok comes down. Okay, never mind. That's how he gets away from it. That's why I'm not a professional player, is now they're mounting the counterattack. Demonte buying a moment here with a stasis, but he's still going to fall over. Golden Guardians grabbing their second kill of the game, and they turn the play around. I'm surprised. Once you get the flash, you can just get out of there. The axe missed. There's no way you're actually killing the Tristana once she burned everything. And Golden yeah. Guardians had everybody there willing to collapse. The Sivir Ultimate being very good at reaching that fight. They'll get a turret for it, saving the Tristana. Even got a teleport to the dragon. Well, someday's going in. He's looking for the 1v1 here against the Tristana, who jumps right into the Q3. That was not the play. Yeah. Not when Q3 is ready, <laughs> the man. The possible plays, that one was not it. Not Jumping when Q3 into the is ready. With Gore Drinker, you don't even have a healing reduction. The man's got a ton of healing, so you don't know. You not only don't get the tier two, but you don't get the dragon. And this is the kind of thing that you really don't need to see from Golden Guardians. I think you've had a good objective there. I don't think you can kill him just because of the healing reduction aspect. That's the one thing. Because someday has flash, because you don't have healing reduction, I don't think that's a play you can actually go for a Blaze Olive. Well, for the Drake, if need be. Throws out the barrel, Void Seeker going in. Grog Assaulty does not knock Demonte the correct direction, and Niles has to flash over the wall to stay alive. 100 Thieves trying to get themselves away, but a nice three-man sleep's coming in. Stick stays going after the kills. Flash away, coming out with a smite to stay alive. Nicely done by... No! I was about to compliment you, man. 100 Thieves loses their jungler. Niles continues to press forward, and Golden Guardians off of the three-man sleep from Iconic will earn their second Drake. Slow and steady wins the raise for this composition, and the play's not done yet. They could go for Baron if they want to. I mean, you do have double carries with Kraken. They're not going to go for it. Olaf was dead. That's the kind of move, though, that I think Golden Guardians could have done if they're really risky there because they all base. I don't know if they're committing for it just yet, though, because Iconic can steal. This could be the opportunity, although someday and who he are on a flank. I think they want the fight, but Golden Guardians knows what's up. Oh, they're going in for it. Someday's going to be here on the front line. TP coming in. Niles has arrived. Who he going to be taking very low? Thrown up into the air by the tornado. It's one kill for one kill here so far. Top laner for the support. Sleep coming in. Someday's now your focus as Iconic goes into the stasis. Staying alive. A little bit more damage wow. goes through. Demonte's finding the damage on that one, but the shutdown goes over to a Blaze Olive. Four dead on 100 Thieves. Golden Guardians takes them out here in the team fight, and now they're the ones going after the Baron. Damante's got a base. He's not even going to be able to threaten anything here. Golden Guardians is playing these fights beautifully, Flowers. That fight, I actually really love Niles' ultimate. I think it interrupted FBI right when he was ulting in, and so he was not able to deal enough damage when he initially went in to follow up his diver, so the carries were able to... Here we go. If this goes over to Golden Guardians, that is an infernal soul. Very, very powerful stuff here for this squad. Closer's moving up. 
Level 15 versus the level 17 on Iconic. It is a smite advantage here for the Golden Guardians, who he's going in, trying to tank up everybody, going in for the damage onto Stixay, who's going to be taken very low, and they grab the kill. FBI is going to stay alive now, too. Niles tanking up here in the front line. Dragon still not taken out by anybody. Niles having to flash away. Demonte also low. Golden Guardians retaining control over the pit. They take down the Drake. It's Iconic there for the smite, and Infernal Soul goes over to the Golden Guardians. They'll continue chasing after 100 Thieves. Yes, they lost their AD carry, but their health bars are still all right. Some days trying to fight back here a little bit, but all of 100 Thieves is stuck around. They're looking to chase after these guys just a little bit further. Closer goes in, and that is exactly what you would expect. Having a Viking fight, a dude with a gun. He falls off. Thing standing here besides the Nexus and its turret guardians. Let's see if they can take this one down. It means double super minions every wave in every lane. And yes, that's the case. Who he with a big oh. engage? Devante with a shock wave to rock the world. FBI grabs the kill on Niles. A Blaze Olive's going to be taken down. Beautiful engage from Hu He and a fantastic follow up from the 100 Thieves mid laner will finally get them a team fight win. But it's so little, so late. They've already lost all three inhibitors crumbs. Didn't I tell you that's exactly how they could do it? The rel combo with Oriana and Kaisa going in. If they catch the carries, it's lights out. And they got both of them. I don't know how they were grouped up. Janna didn't even get to use her ultimate. But once they got the positioning, although Sticks say. A stick save, Killing. forcing Someday into the stasis, uses the spell shield, pops the heal for the move speed, but didn't even need it because death's dance means you bleed Huge. out. With Someday down and stick save pressuring the top lane, somebody's got to stay back there to deal with him, and that somebody is Demonte. Now, Iconic is still down here on the bottom half of the map. If he goes in and makes a hero play for I'll this Elder SCP. Drake, if he goes in and makes a hero play for this Elder Drake, it's down to 2,000, 1,000, slain by FBI. Iconic can't go near that one. Sticks. Big threat of an Oriana shockwave coming out, so they're really worried about that this time. As long as the Monte's here and holding that line, you can see that that ball was at the turret, and now they finally get to push him back since they have split up the members, making the threat much worse. Oh, good oh okay, here's your engage coming out, and Golden Guardians are going to be shredded if they aren't much more careful than this. Niles having to run away. Closer grabbing a kill on that. A blaze all of into the back line. Going to be exhausted. Here is the rest of the 100 Thieves chasing down after the Golden Guardians. Guardian Angels coming up here on both sides. Someday looking to slam these boys right back down into the ground, and 100 Thieves are taking that fight. Someday chases after a Blaze Olive, but he's got to be pretty careful here. Tristana's got the range to bring the pain, and Someday's backing it all the way back out. FBI pushes down, and 100 Thieves have to be respectful of that, but they can't just give over the Elder Drake. Last time around, it was FBI that stole it away here with the Kaisa. We'll see if he can do it again, as the Golden Guardians will try to attempt this Elder Drake. 100 Thieves still hanging out here on the side, ready to go, ready to maybe go in. Elder Drake down to 4,000, 3,000, 2,000, 1,000, slain by the Sivir, and now 100 Thieves are in a bad spot. Golden Guardians looking to maybe... We're still hoping that one of these teams gets a team fight win that... Oh, can oh, end oh. It, but this oh, this is huge. If they actually blaze. kill him there, a Blaze Olive. Oh, no. He loses the Guardian Angel, but a TP's coming in. Another TP's coming in. Everybody's looking and ready to go. A Blaze Olive going to be taken down, and now Niles finds himself in the middle of five. Damage continuing to pour through here as Iconic goes into the back line, and Stix A kills off Closer. Golden Guardians keeping themselves in a good enough spot as Iconic is about to fall over, but the man is dancing and prancing and escaping with about 13 health. What in the world is going on? That is a really good look there from 100 Thieves, but FBI is not by himself. What? They can go kill him. Why would you path that way? Okay, FBI's up here. Somebody's got to save FBI. He's running away now. Niles continuing the chase. He's going to take a lot of damage. Whoa. FBI gets out. He's all right. <laughs> Holy cow. This insane. Sivir does 14k damage in a fight, all right? She will two Late game hyper carries can put out but which one of them will find the angle first? So much of 100 Thieves is up to who he and making these initiations happen. Flash over the wall from Newbie to make sure he does not get caught out of position there. Red buff will be given over to FBI. Elder Drake spawning in 40 seconds. Baron spawning in a minute and 15. DeMonte and FBI staying close together, making sure they're able to protect one another. Guardian Angel once again up and ready to go here for the Kaisa, here for FBI. On the other side of the rift, you have the Guardian Angel almost ready for a Blaze Olive, but not quite there just yet. No Guardian Angel for Stixay, so if he gets focused and combos 
down, the man just drops, and that's it. Golden Guardians will lose a ton of their effective DPS. Someday's not over here just yet. Very important for 100 Thieves to keep dodging away from these Swirl Seeds. Those engages could spell do doom and demise for these guys, as who he jumps over the wall and jumps oh. right into his own death. Nobody else could That's follow it. that up, Puhi. Nobody else was there and ready to go. And 100 Thieves losing their main initiator now have to find some kind of a way to Just stop abs. this. If Golden Guardians get the Elder Drake, Golden Guardians then get the Baron, which means Golden Guardians are in the same spot Golden Guardians have been in for the past 30 minutes, and 100 Thieves keeps having to defend. Iconic's going in looking for the multi-man sleep. The damage is coming down, and Closer's going in, and Stick stays grabbing the kill with the Guardian Angel popping off. Someday trying to tank up here in the front of five, but Blaze Olive coming back to life here with the Guardian Angel. FBI diving into the middle of four, grabbing the kill on a Blaze Olive, now coming back with his own GA. Elder Drake has been secured by the side of the Golden Guardians. FBI going to be taken down next. It's Newbie on the Jana, grabbing the kill on that one. Iconic taken down someday. Delmonte's trying to play it out and kite it out and fight it out, but Stixay is continuing to chase him away. More tornadoes going to be fired off. It is Demonte versus three. The Golden Guardians have their chance to end the game right now, and Niles is not goofing around. The man has made his way into the base. He used the teleport for it just to make sure he was there ASAP. It is Tanner time or bust. Demonte must make a hero play here. He has a shockwave in a moment. He's got who he back alive. Niles is going in, and Demonte's popping the shield, trying to stay in a good enough spot, but it will not be good enough. It did. And for the second time this split, Golden Guardians puts a win on the record after a 56 